those who are attracted to nonviolence should, according to their ability and opportunity, join the experiment. Gandhi, August 11, 1940. The nonviolent aspect of Gandhi's approach here was he never wanted to impress people into his movement willy-nilly. He wanted them to adopt it on their own. Even a small number of people who adopted nonviolence because they felt that it was right, they were called principled nonviolence, would be more effective than a large number of people who were just going along with it for some reason, which is, uh, in effect, how militaries work. They don't insist that you completely subscribe to all the uh, political positions of the army. <laughs> they just insist that you get in there and do what they tell you to do. This would be an abomination in nonviolence. It cannot work that way. It has to elevate and bring out the capacity of every individual person to, as we were saying before, to learn from their own mistakes and form their own conclusions and act on them. <laughs> 